Welcome back. As always, be sure to leave a comment if you have any comments about the channel in general. Any comments about Borderlands 3, this series, all that jazz. Also, a reminder that I will be doing a test stream on Sunday at 7, most likely, Eastern Time. Just a little test stream because I want to start streaming. Don't destroy that monster's heart soon. I fear my very own heart might succumb to this sordid situation. Yeah, so I'm gonna start streaming. Nah, shit, I probably should look up what the actual date is. I'll put it in on the screen. Uh, they were never going to last, those two. I can see it in Wainwright's heart. He knew he couldn't make his betrothed happy. At least this way, he will be part of something greater than himself. A love beyond anything he's ever known. If only you could see that. Damn, I almost just uh, well, ran in there. Ooh. So yeah, we last left off. Uh, Henry slows the ring on his finger, and we're headed to a creepy lab, old doll lab in the woods on a mountain. Uh, so yeah, still love the uh, creepy vibes they got going on here. Very fun. I'm assuming this is where I have to go. I don't feel like looking. I know I'm on Mayhem 1 and not like on True Vault Hunter mode, but this still feels almost too easy. Like, I've done very little side stuff throughout this entire. <laughs> yeah, I still like that though. I like that shit. I'm not saying it's gotta be a hard game, but I remember like having to do side. Maybe, maybe it's just my memory. Maybe it's just because I'm terrible at video games, especially back then. But I remember like. I had to do some side missions for like two. symbol chest I guess nothing even useful in it 
Uh, unless for like a side mission or something. Oh well, wasting my time. Hopefully this mission does not last as long as the last one, because holy shit, that just felt like it dragged on and on and on. <laughs> Alright, maybe I shouldn't use this like word. Is there a point to snipers in this game? I remember, like, I used to, like, my two main things I used in two. I guess I'm making comparisons to two, it's been a long time since I've played. But that's kind of the point of this series, is to go back and replay all the old ones, and then come back to three again, to see if, uh, how I feel holds up. Oh, and also with the, uh, streaming, um, Tales from the Borderlands is definitely one I would stream to get some, uh, like, audience input because I think that would be a much more fun way to do it rather than just, just all right. There's not exactly a lot of gameplay to watch. It's all story shit, so why, what's the point of, uh, playing through and putting them in videos? I'd rather, uh, Get some story input, do like little votes in the chat kind of thing. I think that'd be a fun, fun way to do it. When he has taken a turn for the worse, contorting himself and babbling in tongues, all I can do is sit here and wait. If only our situations um, were reversed. So much better in this sort of thing. Should that be the first game in stream? No. I don't know. Well, I'll talk about that on uh, Sunday. But yeah, like what game to play, what kind of the format's going to be. Just pulling up and whatnot. Should be a fun time. What we got here? Saying it increases action skill cooldowns, going to critical hits. Pierce through enemies and all weapons to increase damage for every enemy pierced. Yeah, let's do that. It feels like I have, like I get all my action skills back like instantly anyway. Like Hammerlock boy almost. The way to the mountain's blocked, and there's some Maybe sort not. of hunting camp. Got any ideas? Ah, ah, yeah, nice shot. Yes, I have read about the local hunting traditions. Do you see a horn nearby? Often we hunters use those to announce our arrival so we aren't mistaken for an animal. Give that horn a mighty blow. Huh. <laughs> horn beat him? So it's welcome by combat. Ah, what a thrill. Have at it, Bolt Hunter. Ah, they yield to the superior fighter, part of the hunter's code, you see. And they're riddled with bullets. It is gonna be a boss fight, isn't it? Yep. Sally ho, Kaido. So a hunter emerges. You have bested my warriors. Well done. Ha <laughs> ha! Oh, I didn't even get a boss. Why didn't he get a boss health bar? He got the splash screen, but not a health bar? That, that makes no sense. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. God damn it, are you serious? Oh, that's dead. Last 
and a half. Less for your ass. <laughs> Happy to help. You are strong, Guido. Follow me. I mean, sure. I guess a fight's one way to greet your guests. How else can you know who you shared your fire and your kite with? Now, let us share tales over the flame. Time to feast. Just in time. I hope you're hungry, Guido. Feast. Nourish yourself for the next fast. I insist. You are my honored guest. I feel damn incredible. What the hell is that? <laughs> Kaif is strength, Kaido. It is power. Now, what brings you to my camp? Heading to that cursed mountain. Sounds like a good time. You journey. Madness. You have bested me, Guido. And so we are now friends. If the cursed mountain is your destination, then I will help you. The path to the Gulfishai lies behind that mighty gate, but the ice that blocks it is unnatural. To melt it, we will need a very special kind of kaif. The kaif. Actually, like funny a Wendigo. You must go to the cave known That's as cool. Kasari Daba, the dark and twisted home of the Wendigo. You will find it deep within the Kankerwood, across the frozen waters. This planet breeds rare and dangerous beasts. Back home, I was the region's tracker, but soon my quarry became predictable. <laughs> Unsatisfying. That is why I came here. No warrior can hunt the same quarry year after year, not without losing his edge. A hunter can never stop hunting. I don't know how I feel about that. I mean, that's, that's cool and all. I was fighting the end ago. But, uh... It doesn't feel very borderlands. I think they would call it, like... I don't know. Something more like a pun, maybe? I shall join you in the woods. My efforts hasten your journey to the cursed mountain, and I must do my part. Eister, your name rings familiar. You aren't the same royal tracker who slew the anti hydra Sukna, are you? <laughs> now that was a slap! One monstrous head! Three, four, and all the realms feasted on kites that winter. I read all about that. 
that hunt in the quarterlies. Asta, I am impressed. You are a fearsome hunter. If you were the same Havelock who slew him over us, the Barkid Queen, it is an honor for our paths to have crossed. We should hunt sometime. Together! Hmm? Oh, yes, that would be delightful. Hmm. That's cool. Just random little one legendary hunter And the hammerlock actually is like a legendary hunter. Wow, look at the stadium. We know him, but what's his relevance beyond he's kind of chilling in the sanctuary and giving us hunting missions? That's cool that he actually has like participated in the hunts and is like somewhat well known. And I like the idea of him coming out and helping us, like, doing, actually going on a legendary hunt with him. He would have him also So hopefully he'll, like, actually be here. And not, uh, not die or get hurt or anything. Like, he's just part of the hunt. Like, he helps us track it or whatever. That'd be cool. Are you kidding me? That that little thing. Oh my god. That's bad. All right. Normally this game's pretty great with that kind of stuff. That was bad. Easter. Easter? Easter? He's pretty fun. He has like the same kind of mentality as Hammerlock, but uh, me, you thorny bushes of the devil. not a gentleman. I do hope I'm not like the savage version of party, Hammerlock. I was developing a terrible case of cabin fever. Well, Shall we track down and kill this no doubt majestic creature together? Always up for a good slash. Let's find that Wendigo. That's the spirit. We hunt. Something, Hamo. Well done. Look at the size of these tracks. That this Wendigo must be fearsome indeed. They're basically just like this. Uh, this way. Areas equivalent of a skag, but they don't. Weekend, I, did not expect to spend quite so much I don't know. It's almost like they're trying too hard to be different. There's something great about this. Thing, this thing. He's just looking. To be honest, I feel a little guilty leaving him at all. Um, here's like the skull heads. It's almost like trying too hard. What who? And kind of going back to what I was saying the last time, like, is it? Is the game just like moving too fast, or it almost feels like I don't really get a good look at them? Maze disappear. Oh my god, I'm just... I'll Thank teach you to grapple with an adventurer! Why are they 
pretty spawn brain for sure. Whoa. The hell? Okay. This one's fresh, we're getting closer. Yes. Bolt hunter. No, never mind. We should focus on hunting this fearsome windigo. What's on your mind, boyo? Get it out now. I love Wainwright. I've never been more sure of anything in my life. It's me I find myself questioning. Winnie really needs someone at his side, but every nerve in my body was pulling me out of that lodge. Or rather. No matter, let us focus. Hmm. You see it now, don't you? His doubts echo the fears I see in Wainwright's heart. Their love is brittle, a delicate thing that cracks at the slightest pressure. Shoulder shooters empty! That's... that's a fun... Well, not Pretty it is an interesting way to take the story of like. Open your bloody eyes! Well, they're both having downs. Did that one have a bounty? Like a big thing. No! You sure? At least I assume most people have their doubts before that. I've never been there. I don't fucking know. But like. At least it seems like a stereotype that, uh. The eyes of a rack, but thankfully not the stench. <laughs> so I guess it makes sense that this outpost is more fortified than others around here. But it seems they've pulled up the drawbridge. See if you can go around and lower it from the other side, Bolt Hunter. I shall stay up here and keep an eye out for predators at your flank. Thank you. Um even though it seems uh Even though it's a bit of a cliche, it is cool that and, and how fantastical the rest of it is, like with the whole cult and the Cthulhu and tentacles and everything, and the ring. Like, that makes sense. They still like actually are still at the core, being like a wedding story of like you know they're both having doubts. Uh, Wainwright thinks he guess I'll give it a whack. Not adventurous enough for Hammerlock, and Hammerlock is like. Conflicted to it. This is terrible. Let's have us a Johnny Brock then. Um, that's just kind of cool. That's Maybe a fun I'll little, take a breather. Fun little, even with all of these, you know, very borderlands. Well, I guess kind of going somewhere in the world. You know what I mean? Like very outlandish, fantastical elements. It still is at least trying to tell a normal wedding story as well. Which is cool. But I like Queen right and uh, Hammerlock. Both, both cool characters. Plus, bring back Gage is cool. Like Still wish uh, X and Salvador made their way into one of these DLCs and not their dumb little whatever real thing, but whatever, whatever. It's fine, it's fine.
Do they? I guess I have no idea. I switch on my weapons, keep it interesting, but god damn it, that sucks. The sniper's just awful. Any more for the meat grinder? Begging for a barrier. Come on. Release those chains on the drawbridge, Vault Hunter. We must find this Windigo. I also like how, yes, a Wendigo doesn't really fit in with uh, tentacle monsters, but it definitely fits right in with the analog story. So it's also cool that they had the time to uh, include that because it's still creepy. I'm sure that's where they kind of got the inspiration for it was just they wanted Just creepy stories, I guess. Creepypasta before Creepypasta is like, what? Your parents will be ashamed of you! Look like a fuck tail? At least it's creepy, you know, like, all those ideas, like, I believed all of them when I was a kid. Like, Bigfoot, the Wendigo, uh, skinwalkers, like as soon as I heard of like any of that kind of stuff, I believe. It. And I grew up so what? Okay. And I grew up surrounded by woods. <laughs> so like I believed all of it. But I was such a weird kid. So I, I grew up surrounded by woods, believed that there was like absolutely terrible monsters and living in there. And during the day, we'd go out there, no problem. Would hear weird noises, but, you know, looking back, it was probably just Let's like... That gate open. I don't know. Deer, fucking rats or something. I don't know. It's just whatever was in the woods. It's nothing dangerous. I don't know, like raccoons and poison ivy and stuff, but that'd be about it. Reveal your secrets. Believe me, all this stuff's real. Still have no problem going in the woods. Not at night, mind you, but during the day, yeah. No problem. All while fully believing that there were like skinwalkers out there and Windigo and Bigfoot. I just figured like, well, I love this law. My parents seem to be not concerned about it. So yeah, I'll be fine. That was basically my mentality as a kid. Yeah, slide, Hammerlock. Why don't you slide? <laughs> I love his run, though. Stench is powerful in there. Let's go in. A rather large creature, isn't it? Or a busy one? Let us pause a moment. A hunter never goes in for the kill until he knows his quarry outside and in. In this case, in.
One by all. Oh, it's a wafer. Ah, the odor of seared flesh. The windigo must burn its prey to death before eating it. Fascinating. Perhaps we'll find its weakness if we keep searching. Ah, that one is mostly bones. The windigo must feed on small creatures and also something earthy. Now I glean the truth in the stench. The Windigo cannot find smaller prey. It feeds on the mushrooms of the forest. Our path becomes clear. We will bait the Windigo first, and then go in for the kill. The first, kill. First, Gisellium Avantis, a rare and deadly paralytic. It won't kill a creature the size of the Windigo, but it should daze it enough to make it a fair sloss. Here. Now, to create an effective bait, we will need she woven meat and the juice of some local anymore. mushrooms. Meanwhile, I'll keep on the Windigo's trail and make sure the devil doesn't elude us. Okay. <laughs> 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 So you think they make it? I'm thinking more like it. didn't have it, like only the big one but you knew this one's a big badass because it has a uh The fact that he's so creepy makes me think that they're gonna do like a 180 that like has really nothing to do with what's going on. He's just like, yeah, he's a creepy, just be a creepy dude. Which makes sense, but also I feel like it'd almost be funny if they pulled a 180 on the 180, like just did a full 360. And, uh,. Just do like a full 360 and actually make him like, he's been creepy the whole time because he's been basically a spy for Eleanor? Is that her name? I, I can't think of who that person is. Okay, what was the point of even having that there?
Hey, a badass. Watch your hiding. Why do I bother with chess? I'm not gonna have I? That's kind of. I think it's supposed to be doing here.
Don't breathe it in. Pick up the mushroom concoction, Vault Hunter. Carefully. Excellent. I believe I've tracked the Windigo to its feeding ground. Come meet me. Oh. Okay. I see what we're supposed to do now. But, uh. Yeah, well. If it works, it works. I was just saying how I like you that. You couldn't we, uh... hit a cow's arse with a banjo. Then we got updates on Claptrap's mission and something. He's actually going on a cool adventure that we're just like missing out on. It's supposed to be a thing to distract him. And now that we actually <laughs> intersect him in this mission. Oh, that's fun. I like that. This is great. Adventure of your own, are you? What's been going on, bud? <laughs> so, I battled a wizard in a contest of wits atop the spire of racking despair. I lost horribly and he imprisoned me, but luckily, I still had Paul with me, so I busted out. But not before stealing an ancient scroll that says the pearl of ineffable knowledge is, and I quote, Waiting just beyond the veil in the wailing chasm of Chikdur Gamash. Well, looks like that's my cue. Gotta go. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I thought he was. We have to like safely get him back to the lodge or something. But no, he's he still is on his adventure. Splendid vault hunter. I like that. Not imagine a better hunting partner. When he isn't one for hunting, he's blind in one eye, you know. But the good one, oh, looking into it sets my heart aflame. Nonetheless, we haven't a moment to lose. To the lair, vault hunter. Being hurt. Oh, yeah. Ouch. We have invited Ice to this hunt. Quite the accomplished tracker, isn't it? Truth be told, I admire his free spirit. Roaming the galaxy, collecting <laughs> trophies and fame. A hunter must hunt, after all. 
Turn around here. Hack through these roots, Vault Hunter. Why do I have to? Here we are, the Windigo's lair. Steal yourself. From what I gather of this creature, this will be no easy hunt. It's gone for the moment. What luck. Quickly now, give me the bait. Give me strength, Winnie. All I do, I do for you. Ooh, I got some. The creature is coming. Here we go. Target is over. I'll what? grapple with an But God damn it. Around, he's got different stage hazards that fall on the ground. Little burning dudes, kind of a little pain, but whatever. Jesus Okay, let's travel too far though. What the fuck? Oh my god. What the fuck's he resisting?
Oh my There we go. Ah, look at those trophies. That must be the kite. Grab them, Prister. Ah, kite is balls. Got it. Oh. I'll be honest. I thought it was just random meat. Okay. Well, I mean that, that's cool too, I guess. The vault hunt. Oh, but still, I gotta change out the. Uh... Before we go, no, we already had this one. Yeah, no. Did I pick up a better sniper? Huh. Maybe I didn't. Oh well. About what I said earlier, about my confusion. When I laid eyes on the Windigo, I felt fear in my heart. Then I thought of Willie. That nothing so pale and formless as fear could ever get in my way. I first became a hunter because, for as long as I can remember, I've always been searching for something. Now I see that I have found it, and I am no less the hunter for it. Now, I wish to be at Winnie's side. You have the trophies. Return with them to Eister. Good luck, Vault Hunter. Okay. Actual time-wise, how is this mission longer than the last one? <laughs> like, that last mission was just dragging on. I think it's because the environment. Like, it was just the exact same looking uh, hotel rooms. Or not hotel rooms, these library rooms. Well, this one actually has a little more variety. Like, there's a, you know, big open frost area, like a frozen lake. Then a neat little mushroom woods, then a little cliff face with a little village. I think that last one was really the biggest problem was just uh, fighting the same enemies. I don't know those things too. Fighting the same enemies in very similar looking rooms. And like almost a grit, like it was very, very bland. Lizzie's has some different areas. I'm not gonna follow these guys getting all the time. Oh, I Because, yeah, this mission has gone on for too long already, I think. Yeah, we're pretty close to about an hour. And, uh, recording time, which is ridiculous. Like, how, how did they. Do that where like the first two missions were like 20 minutes each and then the last two were like an hour each. Mm -hmm. This map doesn't do me any favors either. Oh fuck, I can just fast travel there. Okay, well that, that makes it faster. But 
I stand by that you shouldn't have to do that from anywhere. You know, I did see an explosive barrel in this area, and I thought, like, huh, that seems weird for a barrel in the area. Oh, yeah, just this makes sense. How is this mission not I really honestly thought that, uh, it would have ended with... Like we get here, and then like as soon as we start, like he would talk a little bit, and before we could actually do the ceremony, then we get invaded. Like th this feels like a better start to the next mission than the end of this one. Also, it really wasn't much of an invasion. My friend, let us talk. Those tainted souls have never dared to slash with me before. Black wind is blowing. I smell their putrid scent. The cult grows in power, fed by the monster itself. But there is something else in the air. Perhaps it is their fear, Guido, of you. Ha <laughs> ha! But what of the hunt? What of the Wendigo? I brought those balls back. Oh, sorry. Kaif. Wink. Ha! Ah, Guido! You are not just a hunter, you are one of us now. We cool. will use the Wendigo's fiery kaif to melt the ice that stands in your way. Place the kaif there, and you'll soon be back on the hunt. Such power! This is true kaif, Gaido. Ha <laughs> ha! Beyond is the cursed mountain. They say the wind carries the voices of the past. Many have gone there, but none have come back. May you find that which you seek, Gaido. All right. That was a fun mission. It, it dragged on a little longer than uh, I would have liked to, but it didn't feel nearly as long as that last one, because holy shit, that one was just a drag. This one's a lot more fun. I love the hunting element. I love hunting with Handsome Jack, fighting a Wendigo. Very cool. Uh, so yeah, I'm excited now to actually go to the research base. Uh, but yeah, thank you so much for watching. As always, um, plan on streaming this Sunday. Date will be on screen because I don't currently know, but I'll remember to put it in while editing. Uh, as a little test stream, see what you guys feel, just get all the kinks out. And hopefully start streaming every Monday at like 7. May Monday or Wednesday, I don't know. I'll, I'll put that up to you guys. Let me know in the comments which day will work best. I think just once a week would be fu fine. Either Monday or Wednesday. Uh, so yeah, thanks so much for watching. See you in the next one. Bye.